the first time in a few years, I'm sorry, in a few months, I see the red tail is showing a hint of an interest in food. When I threw the pellets in just now, he came out and uh, checked out the pellets with his barbells. And the big hybrid also came up and stood here vertically, waiting for, uh, hopefully for the fish, which will, come, which will come next. So maybe today would be a, a happy day for us if any one of those or both of them feed even though I doubt the red tail would feed but the hybrid looks almost ready as I said two days ago I saw a bulge or three days ago I saw a bulge in his tummy which I thought that was the second day after the the first or second day after the treatment with formaldehyde and uh, malachite green dye which I thought was some, something regurgitated because after I fed last he didn't, he didn't take anything well we'll see when I give him fish I'm gonna film again alright we're gonna give him fish and see what happens Like he take, he took it. He took it. Good job, baby. He took it. It's been over two months since I gave him the injection of B1, when he was dying and I mean behaved crazy, swimming upside down, not not knowing where up and down is. And that's the first time he, I mean, this is probably the second time he ate something a few days ago, but this is the first documented time that he's, he took a whole micro fortified with vitamins and minerals, as well as with vitamin B1, thiamine, and he took it. The red tail is showing no interest, of course, not yet, as I predicted, as I thought. So this is a great, great job and great, great day for us. This hybrid is about three and a half feet long. We got him, we rescued him from Dayton, Ohio in 2016 from Gerber's Pets. When we went out to save uh, six Peruns, we got him as well. Excellent. The Lyria is showing some interest as well in food, which is a good sign to see. He hasn't eaten uh, anything that I have seen in a month or two. So perhaps something was bothering him and the treatment helped. he wants to have something. You're gonna have some mullet now? Yep, Paco will steal it. You're too slow, baby.
Come on, come on. Move it. No? Okay. He shows interest, but he didn't take it. Still has a huge tummy from prior feedings. He usually feeds like there is no tomorrow, stuffing himself full of food. The red tail is coming over, but I think it's too soon for him. So Paco are gonna pick him off. There is some interest from the red tail catfish and the Lyriae, but not enough to make a move and grab something, so... Paco will not wait around, they will grab it. They will grab the uh, finger mullet. This is our celebrant today. The hybrid fed. That's a great day. So it's safe to say that uh, he was suffering from the vitamin B1 deficiency. It took a uh, couple of months, but I think we proved it. He immediately stopped crazy behavior after the first injection. Two months ago, I gave him another injection about two weeks ago. And now, it's been probably over two months, or maybe two and a half months after the first injection, he fed on film. So we can pen it down to full recovery and uh, correct diagnosis.